In this video, we are going to look at uh, the 2023 GCE Mathematics Paper 2, Question 3. So if you are new to this channel, please subscribe, hit the like button, comment and share. Alright, but A says express this as a single fraction in its simplest form. When you look at this, expression is made up of two fractions and the first fraction is subtracting the second fraction. So what you have to know is that you cannot add or subtract fractions if they have different denominators. They need to have a common denominator or the same denominators. Now, how are we going to make the denominators the same? We'll make the denominators the same by using the concept of equivalent fraction. So what we're going to do is that we are going to multiply the denominator of the second fraction by the denominator of the first fraction. So this is what we are going to do. We will multiply by this by this. 1 minus 4k. Okay. So what we have done on the denominator of this fraction, we also do it on the numerator. Okay. 1 minus 4k. So that the value of this fraction remains the same. If you divide this, you still remain with it, this fraction here. So we will also multiply this denominator by the denominator of the second fraction. So we are going to have this 1 minus 3k. Again, what we have done here, we also do it on the numerator 1 minus 3k like this. So which means we will have 9 then 1 minus 3k, 1 minus 3k over 1 minus 3k, 1 minus 4k. Then minus 8, 1 minus 4k over 1 minus 3k, 1 minus 4k. So now that the denominators are the same, you can see that this fraction here has this, this as a denominator, which is also the same with the other one. So we we'll just pick one of these. So 1 minus 3k, 1 minus 4k. Then pick the numerators as they are. So you have 9, 1 minus 3k minus 8, 1 minus 4k. So now what is needed is just to expand and simplify. So we have the denominator being the same, 1 minus 3k, 1 minus 4k. Let's just expand and simplify the, the numerator. So we have 9 times 1 is 9, then 9 times negative 3k, is negative 27k. So we are done expanding this part. We can now expand the second part. So we're going to say negative 8 times 1 is negative 8. Remember, take note, I'm saying negative 8. I'm collecting together with a negative sign to avoid mistakes. So again, negative 8 times negative 4k is positive 32k. We collect like terms together and simplify. So we have 9 minus 8, which is 1. Okay, then negative 27k plus 32k is positive 5k over 1 minus 3k, 1 minus 4k. This expression cannot be simplified further, so it's in its lowest terms. So which means this is the answer they required. If you are with me up to this point, it means you are enjoying what I'm doing. Kindly subscribe, hit the like button, comment and share. Alright, part B of question 3 says a girl has 7 green apples and 6 red apples in a bag. She picks one apple at random from the bag and eats it. She picks another apple and eats it. Okay? 
So since the question is saying a girl has seven green apples and six red apples, okay, so this is B, it means that the total number of apples is equal to seven or total outcome is equal to seven plus six is equal to 13. Okay, so this there are 13 total outcomes. So the first part is saying draw a tree diagram to illustrate all the possible outcomes. All right, so how are we going to draw this tree diagram? What you have to know is that there are two peaks here. The girl picks one apple at random from the bag and eats it. Again, she picks another apple and eats it. So there are two peaks. So meaning the tree diagram will look like this. So the first peak will look like this. Remember, we have green and red. So because the girl has seven green apples, it means that in the first peak, the girl has the probability of seven out of the total 13 of picking green apples. Again, in the first peak, it means that the girl has the probability of six out of 13 of picking a red apple. Okay, so now this is the second peak. So the second peak will look like this. So again, in the second peak, green, red, green, red. So because the question says she picks one up at random from the bag and eats it. She picks another one and eats it. So which means that, so this means that the girl is, uh, getting the apples without replacing so because she's not replacing it means that in the second peak the probability of getting a green apple will be six will reduce the number of green apples will reduce and because the number of apples have reduced they will no longer be the same it means out of 12 out of 13 they will now be 12. When she picks the green apples, it means the red ones will remain untouched. So the red ones will still remain 6 here. So it will be 6 out of 12. The total is the one that is going to change. So again here, in the second peak, the number of red apples will reduce by 1. So it means she's going to have 5 over. The total again will reduce to 12. So since here red apples are the ones that have been picked, it means the green ones will remain untouched. So the, 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 the probability of, will be 7 out of the total is the one that is going to change to 12. So this is the tree diagram they wanted. For you to make sure that it's what you've done is correct, uh, when you add these probabilities, you should get a 1. When you say 7 over 13 plus 6 over 13, you should get 1. Again, if you add this and that, you should get a 1. Again, if you add this and that, you should get a 1. If you're not getting a 1, it means you've gone wrong somewhere. The second part is saying, what is the probability that the first apple eaten was green? The first apple eaten was green. So, the first peak is this one. Eh? Is this one. Now, the probability that she ate a green, green apple will be taken from the first peak because they are saying, what is the probability that the first apple, so meaning the first peak, so the first peak green is this probability here, 7 over 13. Thank you very much for watching. If you haven't watched the other two questions of this episode of uh, 2023 GCE Mathematics Paper 2, you can just click on the videos that are showing on the screen.